Good morning, good morning. Happy New Year and welcome back to my channel, Dee's Verdict. And I am your girl, Dee, and I'm gonna give you just my verdict on a couple of things that I noticed on the first part of the Love and Marriage Huntsville reunion. There was a lot going on with this reunion, but this part, first part, but before I get into that, go ahead and hit the like button, subscribe to my channel if you hadn't already, because you want to, because you want to hear what I have to say when I say what I got to say. But let's get into it today. The first part of this reunion, usually most reunions, there's, you know, some bombs that get dropped, but they aren't all the way like developed we we're going to see them play out and then by the third part things kind of fizzle down one of the main takeaways that i that i want to talk about today is the conversation surrounding the uh that melody and or production was uh, was offering women a woman money to come on the show and say they had an affair with marceau scott which also triggered Letitia with the bad puppet thing, but we'll get to that later. First of all, the conversation around surrounding Alanda does not make sense. And I'm on my Judge Judy today. When it don't make sense, it's some lying going on. It doesn't add up. So she was going to come on a girl's trip, but, and say, and bust Marceau out. And like, she's going to tell Letitia, you know, that he's, she didn't know he was married. Okay, but be, she wouldn't do that until she was offered money. But Melody told her, I don't pay people. You're going to have to contact production, which makes me wonder why Carlos Scott is playing dumb. But anyway, so Alonda says, well, if I'm not going to get the dollar amount I want, I'm not going to do it. So was it true or was it not? And why was the dollar amount um the triggering factor here so that lets me know that she did some lying because she doubled back and did this cringy weird sister sister wife video with Letitia and Marceau which was very uncomfortable and cringy to me to watch um I don't know what was going on it looked awfully coerced and um orchestrated so the whole story about Alanda may I, I'm really feeling like she was the woman so to me i question her all the way around because money seems to be the whole factor involving her coming and saying that she had an affair with marceau scott so it really wasn't really out of concern for Letitia, a woman being heard. i didn't know he was married and girl let me let you know how low down he was this lets me know that y'all you were clout chasing whoever this woman is and if it's alanda she was cloud chasing so that's all i gotta say about that but the whole conversation on stage between melody carlos and leticia surrounding this whole ordeal about paying someone to come on this show was really weird it did not add up so when it don't add up it don't make sense so there's some missing factors here now, let me be clear. I did see Letitia earlier this year say on a uh, platform that people were offered money to come allegedly lie on her husband. So nobody said it was a lie. It just seemed like the person didn't get the monetary amount they wanted. So I don't know about this, but y'all let me know about this, what you think down in the comments. Will this play out in part two and or three of this explosive reunion i don't know but there are quick i have questions people i have questions okay and if it don't come out in the wash it's gonna come out in the rinse it sounds like the allegations earlier about the person or the woman are adding up but the story surrounding this woman do not add up at all so i want to know what y'all think about this about the whole off being offered money to come on the show and what were her motives because it wasn't to help Letitia, honey don't nobody want to help Letitia. the only person that can help Letitia is Letitia. but that's another topic for another day 
I'm going to wrap it up. My verdict is, is there's some lying going on surrounding this money being paid to come on this show. Melody hands are not clean, nor are Letitia's, Marceau's, and whoever else was involved in conversations with this woman about monetary payment for whatever she was going to come and say on a girl's trip or wherever she was going to say it. That's my verdict today. Let me know what you think down in the comments. Like I said, Happy New Year. And if you haven't, go ahead and hit the like button and the subscribe button and have a great day. And thank you for tuning in.